Hey guys, I'm coming on here to do a video on my apartment here in South Korea. This is a 360 video, so if you can't see me, then you might have to turn around somewhere so that you can see me. But this is the entrance of my apartment. The door behind me goes out of the apartment, and then there's another door in front of me which goes completely into my apartment. Um, the little area that I'm standing in right now is just where you take off your shoes. Uh, to the right of me, I have some shoe cabinets here. Um, it has shoes and just like... I don't know, a bunch of other stuff because this apartment does not have a lot of storage in it. Um, but yeah, so you take your shoes off here and then you go ahead and go through this other door. Alright, so this is the main area of my apartment. Um, go ahead and take a look around with your phone or your computer. And um, yeah, just take a look at how big, I guess, uh, this apartment is. One thing you can maybe judge by is the bed. I think the bed is probably an American full-size bed. So you can probably judge a little bit about like uh, on how big this apartment is by looking at I guess this bed compared to everything else. Um, if you look to the right here, it looks a hot mess, I know, <laughs> but like I said earlier, there is not a lot of storage in this apartment. So I just kind of had to stack all my suitcases here and just like other things that I don't use that often. Just kind of stacked it up in the corner. Um, Alright, so I'm going to talk about what came with the apartment, like what my school provided with the apartment. So the bed came with the apartment, the TV stand, the wardrobe in front of me, and this table and these two chairs here came with the apartment. I did buy this sofa and this in the corner is not like a table or anything. It's actually um, just a plastic drawer and I just covered it with this, this I don't know, fabric <laughs> to make it look... A little nicer that way um, and it's another way to kind of hide some storage in there um, but yeah so this is the main room I spend all my time in here obviously <laughs> um, sleep here I watch some TV here I eat I edit over there all of that stuff all right so after that let's go ahead and move to the kitchen if you look in the front of me there are these sliding doors I really love these doors it makes it feel really like Korea like I guess <laughs> But anyways, let's go ahead and check out the kitchen. Alright, so here's the kitchen. Not a whole lot to show you or to talk about, really. <laughs> um, as you can see, there's not a whole lot of counter space here. Um, this desk, I actually pulled this desk in here from the living room area. This desk was also provided by the school. And um, I put it in here so that I have somewhere to put my appliances. Because as you can see, if I don't have this desk, I have like no counter space whatsoever. So yeah, this is the kitchen. It's pretty small, but it's doable. It is doable. Um, here's a refrigerator. It's not a full-size refrigerator. It's a little bit smaller, but it's good enough for one person. And then the washer machine is also in here too. Washer machine? Washing machine. What's a washing machine? <laughs> the washing machine is also in here. Um, but yeah, so this is what the kitchen area looks like pretty small I do have a big window here but I usually keep these curtains closed because let me just show you right across here is my neighbors it's another building so I usually just keep these curtains closed all right so that's the kitchen let's move on out and go to the last spot oh let me fix my rug the last room or last little area is the bathroom this is what the bathroom looks like in here not a whole lot to talk about or to show you in here. It's just a regular Korean style bathroom. For those of you that don't know, most Korean bathrooms do not have a bathtub or like a shower or anything like that. They just have a shower head and you just shower right here in the bathroom. So yeah, this is all there is to the bathroom. Uh, if you look down to my right, there is a cabinet on the floor. This cabinet is supposed to be on the wall, but um, I kind of like fell. It didn't fall like and make a big, you know, ruckus or anything. Uh, it was just kind of leaning. So then I took it down and just put it on the floor here. And they haven't came to put it back up on the wall yet. So it's just been sitting on the floor. But that's okay. That's okay. All right. So that is my Korea apartment tour. It's very comfortable, even though it is small. I think it's super comfortable for one person. Um, and I think the only problem is, is I think most people have said that their apartment is not as big as this. So like if you have another public school or another hagwon or something, it might not be as big as this apartment. Like it's just 
varies <laughs> between locations and different schools. But it's a general idea of like just having a studio style apartment, a one bedroom um, with like a small kitchen and a bathroom. So that's what I want to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends, share it with your family. Um, I am actually about to move out of this apartment soon, so uh, keep a lookout for my next apartment tour. Maybe it'll be smaller, maybe it'll be bigger, I don't know, but I'm really hoping it's like either the same or bigger. <laughs> but um, yeah, so if you're interested in seeing what my next apartment is going to look like and where I'm moving to, then please subscribe to my channel to kind of, you know, just follow that. Um, but yes, all right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go ahead and end this now and I will see you in my next video. Bye